Now the topic is PC based instrumentation. That is a simply a overview of a PC based instrumentation. PC based instrumentation broadly classified into, into a DDC and CSC. What is a DDC? Direct digital control. Next one is a computer supervisory control. The, first of all, we can see about a DDC, direct digital control. In this, computer measure each variable in the process. A basic DDC is shown in the figure. Larger number of transducers are connected. Each transducer are connected to one of the input of the multiplexer. So here you are having a multiplexer. Large number of transducers in the plant or a factory is connected to the uh, multiplexer. Then the computer has analyzed the data from one or more transducer and it is compared with the appropriate set points in the computer program. Okay. Then the computer senses the appropriate control signal or a data through a data bus to control system. The accurate signal from the transducer through the multiplexer is in the form of analog signal. So we know that the computer that it accepts only the digital data. But the computer accepts only a digital signal. Therefore, the output of the multiplexer is connected with the ADC. So ADC means analog to digital converter. It converts the analog signal to a digital data and given to the computer. Based upon the program which is programmed in the computer, the computer generates a control signal that it is in the form of digital. Then the control signal will be generated that it is in the form of digital. But a transducer is an analog. <coughs> um, actually, the final control element or a control wall or a control system uh, is in an analog device then by using a digital to analog converter that is a D to A uh, convert the digital data from the computer is converted into analog signal then this analog signal is transmitted to the appropriate control wall through a demultiplexer the control console with a display system are used to change the program or set point through a keyboard and facility. Any program or a, we can control, we can program any number of uh, transducer or a control wall through the digital computer console with a keyboard. Here this one is a transducer, this one is a control, uh, control walls or a final control element um, or solenoid wall. This is your multiplexer. Here the output is in uh, analog form, then it will be con uh, converted as a digital form given to the computer. Then the, this will generate a um, control signal in the form of digital. Then the digital data will be con uh, converted as analog given to a demultiplexer. Then the uh, final control element is in the analog form. Okay. This, this uh, transmission and all uh, parallel data transmission. Transmission. Address and control bus, data bus. These are all... Uh, or a um, parallel data transmission okay then next one is a computer supervisory control csc computer supervisory control in computer supervisory um, control a number of local feedback loop using individual process controllers the main difference is here this is the block diagram of a csc in the previous case we are having a transducer and also control wall that will be directly connected to a um, computer with a analog bus uh, analog um, analog signal to a uh, multiplexer and then demultiplexer using individual analog and digital um, uh, analog to digital converter digital to analog converter but here we are having a digital controller for each each variable or a each uh, parameter control each one having their own transducer and a control system this will be connected through a serial transmission through a uh, serial port communication to the computer. That is the major difference between your CSC and DDC. In CSC, a number of local feedback loop using an individual process controller. The main computer merely acting as a supervisor role. The basic CSC system is shown in the figure. In this system, a digital controller has own sensor and control system. One, each uh, control box or a control system that is having their own sensor and control wall or a control system or a solenoid wall to control. The digital control um, uh, controller controls a particular section of the plant. The computer is connected to each digital control. Each digital control that will be connected to a um, uh, supervised control through a serial communication port by means of communication port. By using a communication network, the computer can be tra transmit or receive the data. Thus, by a 
Set points can be easily changed by using a console and then programming keyboard. By comparing CAC with the DDC, CAC using a serial communication. This one is a serial communication. But DDC uses a parallel communication. Therefore, the cost is uh, transmission of uh, data is um, cost is less or 8 bit bus. Therefore, the CAC cabling cost is lower than that of a DTC. That's all.